This video demonstrates the Soldinger technique of suprapubic catheter insertion. There are a list of conditions where SPC insertion may be indicated. However, the contraindications include warfarin or antiplatelet medications, hematuria with clot retention of unknown etiology, indicating bladder cancer which must be excluded, pelvic fractures, abdominal wall sepsis, or vascular grafts such as femfem crossover grafts. Consent must be obtained and the following complications should be listed. Patients with laparotomy scars are at higher risk of adhesions and therefore bowel perforation during the procedure. Image-guided catheter insertion is mandatory in these patients. Prior to SBC insertion, a bladder scan should be performed on all patients. A bladder volume of over 300 ml is safe and the bladder must also be palpable. Aim to insert the SPC no more than 2 cm above the pubic symphysis in the midline. Do not perform the closed technique of SPC insertion if the bladder is not palpable. Gather the necessary equipment and it is always useful to have an assistant but it is not essential. Familiarise yourself with the contents of the Seldinger pack. Unsheath the wire and the scalpel, as this is often difficult to do one-handed during the middle of the procedure. Next, create a sterile field using betadine. Then place your drape over the sterile field and prepare your local anaesthetic. Use a blue needle to begin. Change to a larger green needle for deeper infiltration of the tract. And once the tract is anaesthetized, switch to the Seldinger needle and advance the needle into the bladder while continuously aspirating until urine is seen in the syringe, as demonstrated here. Remove the syringe from the needle. Then insert the soft end of the guide wire up to the first black mark on the guide wire. With the guide wire in place, remove the needle. Place it in a safe area. Then use the blade to create a one centimeter horizontal incision along the wire. Place the trocar over the guide wire ensuring to hold and secure the end of the guide wire. Advance the trocar with a twisting pushing motion into the bladder. Ensure that the trocar and the sheath are inserted the second black mark on the guide wire. Remove the trocar and cover the hole with your thumb while reaching for and inserting the catheter. Once the catheter is in, Inflate the balloon with 10 mils of water for injection, then peel away the sheath. Connect the catheter to a catheter bag or urometer. Remember to open the clamp and place the bag on the floor. Remove your sterile drape and apply a dressing to the SPC site. Remember to document your procedure fully. Note the colour of the urine and the residual volume after 30 minutes. SPC insertion guidelines and algorithms including post-insertion care have been published by the British Association of Urological Surgeons. The link is provided. I hope you've enjoyed this video and found it useful. Thank you.